Watch you guys, got another ransomware removal video here for you. This one's a URC uh, variant, which is called Urem2, which is a new variant of a uh, URC. And uh, there's three types of it. There's the UK version, the French version, which I'll show you the image for a little bit later on, and the American version. They're the three versions at the moment that are doing the rounds, okay? Now, I wasn't going to make this video, but I made it because in case someone gets infected with it and they haven't watched any of my other videos and they don't know where to remove it from so I'm going to quickly show you how to remove it, it's really easy to do honestly um, but what they're basically trying to do is con you out of your money and you can see here they're asking you to go to uCash and pay safe card and uh, type in your number that you've just paid for and then you pay okay but don't pay for it because it is a scam and they will con you out of your money so let's uh, just basically show you how to remove this it's pretty easy now you can't do it in safe mobile networking because it will just reboot and I'll show you that right now okay so I was tapping F8 on the keyboard there and I'll show you what happens in safe mobile networking it will start up like this and then it will shut down like that so what we're going to do is we're going to go into safe mobile command prompt here now you can use Kaspersky rescue CD this will ought to do the trick for you uh, but I'm just going to quickly manually remove this one because I've covered it so much just let this load up okay so now we're at the uh, command prompt window so we're going to type explorer just like so this will load up our desktop and I'm going to delete that file there so once we've done that what we're going to do here is just go to our computer C root directory users then the account that's infected app data and then roaming and inside here you'll see these two files just delete those two okay we're going to come out of there now I'm going to go to reboot here and reboot the system just let this load in and there we are back at the desktop pretty simple to do now you can run malware bytes which I would advise you to do and also TDSS killer to make sure that you've got no rootkits on the system and also run Hitman Pro okay now the the actual screen that you're seeing on there at the moment is the French version that you could be getting if you live in France and if you live in the US you'll be getting the US version which you should be seeing on the screen right there as well okay so as I said just run Malwarebytes to tidy up any bits that are left behind and I'm just going to quickly do that always do an update there and then click scanner and then run a quick scan okay that's the scan now finished as you can see there's three detected and uh, in the recycle bin there and we've also got some other bits and pieces log on and we'll just remove those and fix that up now that's that one done and it wants to restart I'm not gonna bother but you should be restarting here and then run hitman pro straight after that okay so anyway I think that's gonna be about it for this video I hope you enjoyed it my name is Brian from brightechcomputers.co.uk if you enjoy these videos guys hit that subscribe button and share support by rating and favorite all my videos and I'll be making more videos again in the future. So thanks again, guys. Have a great weekend, and I'll see you real soon. Bye for now.